So in this video, I am going to show you how to add the Hekin Ashi candlesticks to your MT5 charts. And I will also show you a strategy that you can use in order to trade the Hekin Ashi candles. It is a very simple strategy and it is also profitable, especially if you are a beginner in forex trading. So in your MT5, you go under your charts, make sure you are under the charts here. Once you are there, you, what you are going to do is to tap on your screen. When you tap on your screen, these options come out. You are going to select the settings. So we are going to change the candles, the types of candles that we are using on our chart. So I will click on this. Over at the top, where it is written line type, we want to change the type of candles that we are using. So I will click on that. You can see we have the bar chart, line chart, and the Hakin Ashi chart. So I am going to click on the Hakin Ashi chart, and that should have been added to our chart. We can now click on the back button, and we have our candle. Now, this is not a regular type of candle that you see on your chart, even though you are seeing it with wicks and you are seeing it with other um, colors, just as the previous ones. But when I enlarge it, you are going to see that it is quite different in that some of the candles do not have wicks at the bottom if price is buying. So if price is pushing upwards, you will see that the candles will not have any wick or shadow at the bottom, such as this other particular candle. You can see this other particular one here. They only have wicks at the top if price is buying. Now when you see that price is continuously going to start selling, is the same thing too you will see. If it's bearish, you will see that the candles will begin having only the wicks pointing downwards that's the direction but they will not have wicks at their tops you can see how effective it is how the strategy is so that is the difference between the hekin ashi candles and the regular candles the japanese candlesticks that we know and the common ones that we use so i am going to show you how i trade these particular candlesticks especially how i use it for intraday trading and you can also use it for scalping or for swing trading but showing you how you use this for swing trading and for scalping is in another video so make sure that you are subscribed to the channel so that whenever i post a video you can be notified especially when you click that notification bell so i will show you the strategy that i apply while using this we are going to add our ema to the mt5 chart that is the moving average exponential or what some people refer to as the exponential moving average so i'm going to tap on the screen again but this time around instead of this particular point i will tap and go under this symbol so you click on that you can see there are a lot of them that have hidden for the purpose of this video so go to this f plus that you are seeing click on it and you are going to select your moving average so exponential moving average is a type of moving average so we are going to select the type of moving average that we want under methods that you are seeing we are going to click and i will select exponential so i am interested in the exponential moving average the period that we are considering i am considering the 50 periods so edit your period to 50 period and that is essentially what we are going to be using if you are the type if you have any color blindness or anything you can change the size of the line of your ema and you can change the color of the ema as well 
it's on red so you can increase the font the thickness of your ema line so we now have our 50 ema added to our mt5 chart you can click your save here under the save option it is saved so we can go back by clicking the back button and we have our 50 ema added to our chart this is how we are going to be trading this so what i will want you to do is that you should only buy the market when you see that there is a candle that closes above so we are looking for a candle that closes above our 50 ema that shows that we are in an uptrend and the candle must be a green candle and the bottom must not have a wick so for this one we are seeing that this candle this green candle closed above our 50 ema but it has a week this one closed above our 50 ema and does not have a week this shows that we can take our entry however you can see is far away from your ema already this was as a result of the nfp news that just passed just last week so it gave this you may not have an entry and i don't even advise anyone to trade news you wouldn't have entered at this you will wait for price to retrace downwards once price touches your 50 ema you are going to watch out if you see any of these candles again above your ema you are going to take your entry at the close of that candle and your stop loss will be below the previous red candles that were printed before this one was printed and you will aim for one to two or one to three now the ema uses trends so if you want to hold this type of thing you can hold this type of trades pending when you see that this bearish type of candles will come and break below this 50 ema and begin to print candles that are bearish without weeks at their tops and they are pointing with weeks downwards so when they cross your 50 ema and they begin to go downwards you will exit your trade but if you were holding this at the entry here you can see you will still be in this trade as price is pushing upwards and is forming and even if you had missed this entry you will still have another entry here you can see there is another entry here so for those that like adding positions you can add positions if you take your entry here any profit you've made from your point of entry to when you see this pattern again you will add position using that profit that you have made and you continue to ride the trend like that you can see another thing again over here once price taps into your 50 ema and it gives you this type of pattern this candle this hacking ashy candle you will take your entry for a buy and you will continue like that we will only exit this when we begin to see that the price is below now is below the 50 ema and the hacking ashy candles are beginning to be bearish showing us these particular ones that do not have wicks at their tops now that is how i trade this for intraday trading if you want to apply this to your scalping you just simply change to your five minutes time frame and it is also going to be the same principle that you will be looking out for this candle close above and it does not have a wick at the bottom so that will be our entry point our stop loss will be below here and if you have any question regarding how to add the hacking ashy candlesticks to your mt5 chart and also how to use them for your day trading just let me know in the comment section do have a wonderful day bye